What's up, YouTube? It's your boy again. Coming back to another video on this channel. So, I'm going to do three places today. All three on Mara Ray. Except for one that's... I'll, I'll explain a little bit. So, I, yesterday, I'm just super exhausted, so I didn't want to make a video. Um, just tired out of... Just out of it completely. But anyways, yesterday I went to two places. Number one, I went to... I'm going to butcher the name, so I do apologize. Yeah, if you're wondering, I'm looking at the receipt. Uh, Tor Toya, T R O Y Baklava Cafe, had myself a uh, had myself a Turkish coffee for about six bucks. With taxes included, came out to six dollars fifty one cents. Good cup of coffee. I mean, I'm a, I love coffee. Turk, it's a good place. I sell lots of baklava, so if you're interested in baklava and or Turkish coffee, I do suggest this place. I was the only one there, so I don't know if I just went there at a different time or not. But anyways, overall, it's a good place. I do recommend this place. Thumbs up. Um, also, again, links in, links in the description box down below for all these places. Um, so you can check it out on your own. The other place I went to yesterday was Ghirardelli. You're probably wondering, wait, I thought Gerald Lilly was in San Francisco. And you're right. It is in San Francisco as well as in Mon in Monterey. And I think it's in a few other locations too. I'm not totally sure about that part, but definitely this is the same one this is the same Gerardelli as the one in San Francisco. So this one here again I'm just gonna to do a review on this uh the one the Ghirardelli in Monterey, not the one in San Francisco, which I think, uh, which is the original. But anyways, this one is great. Just like the original, out of 10, I would give this a 9. Again, nothing beats the original, but that's just my opinion. Oh, I forgot to do a review for the other one. Tora, I think, I think I did. But anyways, Tora... <coughs> Toro Baklava Cafe at a 10. I will give it a 9 too. Again, I just had the Turkish coffee, so not much, not too too much to judge there. The other place, so today for lunch, I went to a place called Wave Street Cafe. Great place, good food. Uh, I had this, so what's it called? The uh, fish tacos? Small little things. I think it's like less, like one of those like, soft shell tacos you get in like uh, Chipotle. But it's good food, really good food. It tastes fresh and everything. Um, the vibe, service. Well, let me start off with service. Service for this restaurant here was a ten out of ten. Super fast, super, um, super friendly. Everything else, no complaints about the the service. The atmosphere was also nice. It seemed more like, at least to me, it feels like it would be better with company. So like a group of friends or family members, whatever. Um, but again, that's just my opinion. Food was also a 10. So all across the board, 10 out of 10. No complaints about this place. Uh, good food, great atmosphere, good service. All right. Um, the only issue I had with it is a little bit pricey. I ordered two things. I had a beer and a soft soft tacos, and the, which came with like a little bit of beans and some a salad. That came out to about $27.00. And 12 cents so let's say tip tax and everything included so it is a little more on the pricier side but in my opinion it's worth the money so that's all see you guys in the next video have a good one peace